Okay. So starting Monday, I am going to do my sunset fast or the Daniel fast, as they call. That's where you eat once a day after sunset. And the idea is to eat only vegetables, beans, legumes, drink water, fruit. You can have fruit. But thank, thankfully, Whole Foods delivers now. So I was able to get some of the really good stuff that's healthy. You know, this is one meal right here, jackfruit. It, jackfruit actually tastes like pork. And this is a good 10-ounce meal right here. Now, now I, you can have as much as you want, though. So I got enough for seven days. I got the jackfruits, another jackfruit meal right here. And then you can have, I can have the barley and the green lentils. That's another meal right there from Whole Foods Delivery, which is really good. Then I got the Dozen Cousins right here, another 10-ounce Mexican, uh, the cowboy beans, which is, you know, this is some really good stuff. It's really healthy. And then I can have the, anything organic, like this is a meal right here. You know, I can have it, I can have a lunch. Uh, oh, and the vegetable uh, tikka marsala, the masala right here. Good stuff, good stuff. And you can only drink water, so I had to get the good water. I also got another masala right here, the Indian masala right here with kidney beans. Mmm, yum, yum, yum. No added additives to that. And then the doll, the everyday doll right there. So, and then I got these meals. And then the filos right here, the Tex, the, the Tex-Mex pinto beans. All that good stuff. And I got the good water. I got the Italian sparkling mineral water. Plus, I got a case of just regular 365 water. But this here is going to be a seven day. This is what I'm going to eat in seven days, starting Monday. The idea is to deny yourself the, uh, you know, the, the junk foods that we like, the meats, uh, no meats, uh, comfort foods. So over the weekend, I'm going to eat really good. <clears throat> I had some fried chicken and uh, baked beans and mashed potatoes. And then earlier, we had a pretty good breakfast. Uh, Scrambled eggs and, and uh, waffle fries and biscuits and gravy. So I'm going to eat good over the weekend, right? And then for seven days, this is the, this is a seven-day supply of sunset fasting food. And I got it all from Whole Foods Delivery, which is really good. This right here uh, with the case of water, this right here ran about 70 bucks, which isn't too bad, you know, considering it's all Whole Foods. Oh, yeah, and this one right here. Mayokuba. Yeah, that's really good. But jackfruit is one of the best things that you can put in your body. It's a, it's like a miracle. It's a miracle fruit. I mean, these, some of them are like, a, you know, can grow up to 100 pounds. But it, it looks like chicken and pork, and it tastes like, it tastes like pork. You can't tell the difference between pork. But this is a good 10-ounce meal right here. And, and uh, I, I like beans anyway. So I can do this, the filled peas and snaps. I can do the triple succotash. I had one of the, I did fast for 24 hours and this is what I ate. And it was pretty good. So the idea is that when you're fasting, you're going to deny yourself the fleshly desires that we like. Pleasure foods and stuff like that. You know, and you, you, you eat once after sunset. And if you get hungry, you can eat, you can eat between them. But the idea is to eat once after a sunset for seven days. And while you're not eating those pleasure foods, you're denying yourself those foods. You you are supposed to spend more time reading your Bible, doing a lot more praying, and and uh, getting closer. It's a spiritual diet as well. So that's what the sunset fast is, or the Daniel fast. You know, when Daniel fasted, he was able to have visions of good uh, spiritual visions that helped him out a lot. So starting Monday, actually from Sunday. At about 6 o'clock, I'm going to stop eating, and then I'm not going to eat again until Monday, about 6 o'clock. Then I'm going to go for seven days that way. And uh, it's, it's supposed to, it's the first time I've ever fasted this long. It's supposed to help you draw closer to God and get your mind right and get your body right. And it, it pleases Him. It pleases Him when you deny yourself those uh, fleshly desires that you have, you know, like, because who doesn't like a nice cheeseburger besides tomorrow? Uh, who doesn't like a, a, a pizza or something like that? I can't drink anything but water. I got a case of water over there, too, 
But this is the good stuff. I can't wait to get into one of those, actually. But tomorrow all day, I'm just going to eat and eat and eat and eat. And, and uh, you know, the idea is you don't want to, you want to eat a good, healthy meal before that. <clears throat> and then when you come off of one of these fasts, <clears throat> you're not supposed to celebrate by having a, a bash fest because that can actually, uh, that can actually hurt you. That, 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 that's not good for your body to do that. So, uh, I'm going to, I'm going to record each day, you know, cause I like to eat, man. I see somebody threw a Skittles in there. I can't have that, <laughs> but, uh, I like to eat. So denying yourself of fleshly desires is very, uh, God, he, he, that pleases him. He likes that when you do that because you do it in his name. You do that for him to show him, Oh, this looks really good. Kidney bean, carrot. Uh, that looks good. That looks like chili. Uh, I, well, I kind of can't wait because it's going to get me healthy both ways. Most of these are Indian foods. So it's going to get me healthy both ways. You know, I'm going to come closer to uh, God that way. And then you're supposed to, do, the times that you're not eating like this, you're supposed to give up all other, like I'm not going to be, I'm going to be into the reading more scripture, praying a lot more, and uh, just coming out of the human fleshly desire stuff and just putting this seven days aside for for god and it's supposed to help me grow spiritually it will too because greater is he who is in me than he who is in the world so wish me luck